my eyes um just doing some more haul videos as we went shopping again today i think this is the last kind of big shopping day um for this month pretty much um i think we're just going to do little shops after this i have been to hobbycraft tk max smith's toys the range b and m and I think that's it. So I'm going to do two or three videos today and I'm also going to film the Blue Nose haul as I've got to go through and sort out what double she's got and stuff to sell. So I'm just going to jump straight into it. We're going to start with Hobbycraft and then depending on the time I might do um, a little bit more. There's some things I can't show you because they are for a secondary swap coming up with Heather as I've already done the first one already. So, um, yeah, this is the second one, so I will tell you what I paid and what I've got. So the first things are, we have two of these Cheeky Monkey Crafty Monkey Art Fun Painting Kits. And they just look like that. These are from Hobbycraft, as all of this is. And you get that lot on the side. These were originally £4, no, they were originally, sorry, £6 each, and they went down to £2 each, so I got two of them so yeah um, can't show you that one I got two of these and they're really cute they're like Diamantes the stickers I got two of these though these are butterfly stickers and these were 50p each and these are originally 1.99 each so I got two of those I got some puffy owl stickers for a pound. These are just to go in my daughter's scrapbook. I got some little bags of buttons. These are for something that I'm going to do a DIY on. These are 50p each, so I got two of that colour and two of the like, Christmassy colours. Sorry about the light in it's a bit crap. Sorry, that might not have helped. I also got this Crafty Monkeys Finger Puppets 4-pack. This was 50p and originally it was £3. So I got that one. I got some of these little adhesive bows for my daughter's scrapbook. These were a pound. I got some cake and lollies and stuff for her scrapbook these are more stickers again these were a pound I got some more butterflies these are like you can kind of see through them and these were a pound I got some of these little paint sets which I thought were quite cute these little paint sets were 30p each and I thought these would be quite nice to put in a Christmas stocking. So I got one, two, three, four of those. And then I those buttons. I got these little punches for a pound each down for three pounds each. So I got a little, little reindeer. I got a little, what do I show you? Holly leaf. I got a snowman. And I got a Christmas tree. I also got these were originally two pounds, but they were down to a pound. These are just like princess candles. These are for my daughter's birthday. I also got I fell in love with this, so I thought I'm gonna frame it and put it in a room with something on. So it's just felt and it's just got glittery stars on it and baby pink, so I'm gonna put that in a room. I'm gonna frame it or do something with it. I also got some of these little diva and princess rings, which looks like, yeah, they've been smashed. See, they've got this bit smashed and this bit smashed. So only some of these can be used, only one, two, three, only four of these can be used out of a seven pack. These are originally two pound and they're down to seven pound but they're just little princess rings. They're going to go in some of her stockings. I'm not quite sure where that's come from, but... A little stick on thing has stuck to something, and I can't show you that one. I can show you that one. I can't show you that one because that's a part of the swap, right? So these are princess pop tops. 
So they just go on the top of your cake and they're just cardboard. This would be quite cute for her cake, so I can get her a generic cake. And we just got these. These were originally three pound, I think. And yeah, they were down to a pound. So I got that lot from Hobbycraft. And <sighs> where to start next? I'll do the bit from Smith's Toys since there's not much from there. And then depending on the length of the TK Maxx. So from Smith's Toys, we went in to get my daughter a car seat, as my mum's got her car back now, and my daughter needed a car seat, and they had three for two on, so I can't show you some of the things I bought, um, but they had three for two on these things, so I picked up one of these, which I thought was really good for the changing bag. It was 4 99 and it's, there's your lid for it, and it's just a pop-up, it's a mun munchkin pop-up bowl, and I thought that would be so good for putting in the changing bag you just like flap it down and put the lid on i thought that was brilliant it was 4.99 so um yeah we got that one and then my daughter's friend uses these they are completely um leak proof basically they create a seal at the top and until the, the child puts their lip on the edge here it doesn't break the seal which means the water doesn't come out so yeah we bought one of these this was 5 49 but it was in the 3 for 2 one again. So I think the... Uh... Yeah, because we bought this one and the bowls, I'm going to show you this one was free. So yeah, we bought a big one of this for my daughter. And the last thing from there that I can show you is these nubby, stackable, silicone sticky bowls. Basically, they've got a suction plate. This yellow bit here is a suction plate. So when you put it on like the high chair, it suctions down to it so they can't pick it up and just throw it off suctions down to it so they can't move these were five pound ten i think they were and you get two in the packet and they both got lids as well this one's got a green lid and this one's got an orange lid so i thought they were quite good so we bought those and i can quickly do tk maxx in the same video and then i will uh start another one so this is one of the things we bought in TK Maxx. This is a giant A to Z colouring book and you get pictures like this. It tells you all different dinosaurs and that lot. This was originally four ninety nine, and it was down to two pounds. So I thought that was a bargain. And I can't show you that one. Can't show you that. Right, we got these. I thought these would be quite good to resell for people that make stuff. These are Mason and Cash stainless steel dessert moulds. And they're just squares. Brand new in the packet, apart from the packet's broken. These were originally £9.50 and we got them for 50p. So I thought these would be good to sell on. Or put into some of these like gift box that's like very into cooking and stuff. I got these flashcards that were originally £8 down to £2 and I thought this would be, this is baby's first work, baby's first year's first learning words, 30 double sided flashcards to complement children's learning and it's got like a picture of puppy and a puppy underneath and stuff like that so I thought these were quite good for my daughter. I got, I got one of these in here and then I got some in somewhere else. This is just a robot sharpener and sticker sheet for decorating your bottle so basically you put him on top of a water bottle like you put him on top of say that and your pencil sharpeners would go into here and you can decorate your bottle so like the bottle there that you can decorate it he was originally four pounds down to 50p so i thought it'd be a nice little like stocking filler stupid jokey thing um, I bought this one from my daughter's room this is just a mirror in the shape of a lion and it's not proper mirror it's plastic and it includes tabs to easily attach your mirror to your wall yeah it was originally 9 99 and four pounds which I thought would be a nice little thing for her room they're out for charity shop. I'll show you these. These are a British Heart Foundation. She loves these. They're just plastic blocks. And these are £1.49. But 
but all that is some TK Maxx. I got this for one of her presents for when it's her birthday next month. These are six cards and 24 blocks. My first memory game. These were originally $13.99 down to five. And I thought that was a really nice little present as it's Fisher Price. It's really good and everything. So yeah, I thought that was quite a good little present for her. We have a hamster and I saw these na Nature's First Grassy Sticks, the perfect na natural toy for small animals. And these were originally three seventy nine, and I got them for a pound. And they're just bits of grass, basically, and they can sit and chew them. So I got that for him, her, her. I got some of these as well. Let's see one. Let's see one. I thought these were quite good again for a chefy person. These are spice mix ready rubs for roasted meat. And these are. Carastrum? I don't know. The pre prepared rubs, anyway. They were one ninety nine, and they were down to a pound. I thought they were quite good. The fact that you get the spatula with it and the rub. I got two. To me, they look different, but they're not. Oh well. But I looked at the date. These are the first thing I did was it's twenty sixth of the eighth, two thousand and eighteen. So they go out of date in a while, like a long time. So I thought these would be quite good, even if I put them back for Christmas and put them in like. One of our family members really likes cooking, so I thought these would be quite good for them, and I can put them in stockings and stuff. So I got. Hi. So it's just fallen off the bed, sorry. It's my. This is my bed at the moment. Piled to the hill. So I need to sort out. Anyway, back to. I'm just going to finish off the TK Maxx haul, then that'll be this video done, and then I'll pack all this away, and I'll do the haul that we've done today from the range and. B&M we didn't really get a lot in, um, but I'll show you B&M, that's downstairs at the moment, and I will do the Blue Nose haul, that's the main ones I'm doing. Anyway, we got this tub of um, champagne and strawberry fudge, which I thought was really good. Um, it doesn't go out of date till the 5th of the 4th, 2018, and this was originally... This was originally 3 99 and it's just a plastic tub with yeah just the fudge in it and it won't ding yeah and like i say 3.99 down to a pound champagne fudge i thought it was a nice little present i thought these were handy to keep in the car these are just i think they're called Ger good from burt's bees natural cleansing wipe blood orange flower scent and they're 10 wipes and these were originally RRP of £7.55 and then they were selling them for £2.99 and I actually got them for 30p. There's nothing special about them, it's basically just a bloody wet wipe with orange smell. But I thought these would be ideal on the glove compartment of the car. I got this, which I don't think it's going to fit our oven door, but if not, it will fit our friend's oven door. And this is a clever mama, designed by mums for mums, oven door lock protecting your child. I just thought this was a really, really good idea. Our oven doesn't come down top to bottom, it goes side to side, but I just thought it was a really good idea. It was three forty nine down to one pound. Which I thought was a bargain. And then all the rest is pretty much chopped up apart from this one thing. These are high handmade marshmallow melts, Madagascan vanilla. And dip, stir and melt. So basically you dip the marshmallows that are on the stick into your hot chocolate and it makes it taste of vanilla basically our ingenious new way to flavor your hot drink our scrumptious marshmallow melts are delicious confectionery but with a twist handmade using natural flavors and local produce where we can to our own secret recipes dip stir and melt our luxurious creations into your favorite hot coffee or chocolate sit back and watch as they melt into a creamy flavorsome frothy topping for extra oomph, sip your drink through and melt through the melting marshmallow froth. Save your mallow melt moment. Anyway, yeah, I thought they're marshmallows. They don't go out of date until next year, and I just thought that was a really cute little present to put in. I thought if you've got like a, a mug and put some like those little hot chocolate sachets in it, and um, this I thought it'd just be a little nice present. These were 50p don't know how much they were originally because it didn't say and then basically we got chocolate because 
yes it looks like Christmas chocolate but at the end of the day it's chocolate you can chuck it in your lunchbox and it really doesn't matter so that's what I got it for so this is a snowman chocolate character these were originally £3.50 each and they were 50p so I've just got a milk chocolate snowman character it's just like a snowman inside a solid chocolate egg and then I got three of these yeah that one sticks broken off three of these and these are just milk chocolate lollipop with sprinkled stars nothing exciting these are originally a pound each and I got them for 50p and I just thought they are literally just take that ribbon off it says Merry Christmas and it's just a bloody chocolate star with sprinkles and this one it's just fallen off it's just the star with sprinkles it doesn't really matter and then I've got two chocolate baubles which are chocolate baubles with inclusions oh I see with the Smarties on top just basically a hollow chocolate ball with white chocolate on top with Smarties on top and this one's just a hollow chocolate ball and it's just got a snowflake icing and it got smashed when I put it in the bag and these were two nines and nine each down to 50p so I got those two and that's all I got in TK Maxx so I'm going to leave this video here I'm going to pack away all that lot and then I will be back at you with the blue nose haul because I have two boxes and two massive bags of blue noses um, I have to go through all of them and sort out which ones are double so I know which ones we're going to be selling on but yeah and I've also got a uh, the range haul so I'll be back with you soon so hope you're having fun and stay tuned bye